Okay, Jürgen Persson, famous uh, table tennis player. You're here in Budapest in what role? Uh, you are a coach or...? Yeah, I'm coach for Sweden, yes. Swedish team? Swedish team, yes. Uh, what are your expectations from this World Championships in Budapest? From your team, from uh, generally from World Table Tennis? <laughs> yeah, generally for Sweden, of course, you're always hoping if we can come here from here with one medal, we will be very happy. I mean, uh, three, three chances, single, double, mixed, maybe we have the best chances in double. We have uh, Christian Carlsen and Matthias Falk, who was lost World Championships that were in quarterfinals. Mm -hmm. But of course, I'm also hoping that we will have some surprises from the Swedish team. We have a lot of young players also coming up here. So, Schultz Mörgård is one, Anton Kelbe, and of course we have Matthias, who is seeded among the last uh, 16. Mm -hmm. And uh, then, of course, in the world, so if you look all the world, yeah, of course we receive someone can beat China. I mean, they are big favorites in all classes, and we receive someone can take them down yeah, if it's uh, Japan, Germany or Korean players or Swedish players maybe we will see or how, Taiwan yeah. <laughs> how do you think who is uh, from uh, Europe is um, capable to win a uh, medal here <laughs> which capable is yeah, no surprise that it's uh, Obsharov of course and Timo uh -huh. is the biggest and a small chance for yeah, like uh, Vlad is still there, yeah. He has uh, not so big chance maybe for men, but he's still good. Uh, and, and, and of course I hope that our Swedish Matthias, Falk, yeah, or maybe a young player like Simon Gassi from France, yeah, that some new is coming. That would be nice. After this generation of you, uh, Janu Wallner, uh, Appelgren, it was a little bit gap in, in Swedish table tennis, but now it's uh, again uh, in, in the top. Yeah, What can you uh, say yeah. about Swedish table tennis and its, its future? No, but it's looking bright, the future. I mean, last World Championships team event, we were number three, lost to China. Mm -hmm. And the young players are developing, yeah? And we have, like, a little mix now. We have a young person is the oldest. And then we have Matthias and Christian, not so old, 28. And, of course, Anton, only 21. And Tulls is 17, yeah? Mm -hmm. So we have a good team coming up. And it's also positive in Sweden after the last World Championships, yeah? That people in Sweden say, oh, we are coming on this level again, like we were before, maybe. Yes? It looks it's very bright and it's it's nice. That's why it's fun to work now also with the team. Thank you. And maybe your prediction for uh, men's singles. Uh, who is your favorite? <laughs> I think that uh, maybe it's time for Fang Shidong. Fang Shidong. Fang Shidong have been really good. And the last World Championship, he and Malong had a fantastic final, yeah? yeah. So, but, but they will play in semi-finals this time, yeah? Ah. So, but I, I predict maybe it's time for Fang Shidong to win mm. a big title. Thank you. Good luck to the thank Swedish you. players. Thank you, thank you.